you guys have already seen the title and the thumbnail, but before I get on with this video, I just want to let you in on a few things really quick. So I know I've said before in a few videos for when it comes to certain social medias of mine that I was never going to show them off ever again, but due to the fact that, you know, not a lot of people were able to process all of that at once, uh, here is my user for Discord, my uh, user for my PlayStation 4, and the games that I play off of on there. Uh, Roblox, I literally say it through every Roblox I do nowadays. My user is always mentioned throughout there and in the description. There will be a link in the, or not the link in the description. There will be something in the description. You know, as always, as like how normally, what my Roblox user is. It's here on the screen and in the description. Uh, for Among Us, I'm pretty sure I've only ever shown off my user maybe once. But if not, and it only came across as a little glimpse, then here it is. If you ever wanted to go play with me on there, or, you know, if you ever wanted to be featured within a video, or, you know, just play with me in general. Same for Roblox. Like, if you want to do a video or if you want to play in general. Uh, it won't be for certain if I do ever add you back, but I will try my best to, like, if you're a subscriber of mine. And then as for Pokemon Go, I've already showed my friendship code off to you. Uh, it's not any different as how it was before. Not that it could really change. And not that I'm ever really going to do a video off of that. But if you ever wanted to go add me on Pokemon Go, my user is DaddyGlory1. For anyone who were confused or who want to know what my name is along with the friendship code to which I've already given away before. But yeah, you know, stuff. But, um, continuing forward, remember when I made that plan to when it comes to, you know, FNAF they are and, you know, the characters added within it that I would show them off each time there's a new character or skin added in with it? Yeah, well, long story short, that's no longer going to happen anymore, and here's why. So, not too long ago, news has gotten around, and, you know, first it started off as rumors, but then it was kind of be true. So, right here it says, Illumix Official has officially moved on from FNAF AR game. They have created new, Twitter's account, or new Twitter accounts and a new website that have no relation to the game and are giving the impression of a new start for the company. Note, and they never announced the end, they pretty much abandoned it. So, long story short, Illumix have completely given up on Five Nights at Freddy's special delivery or FNAF AR and uh, considering that they have I don't know if the game will still be up on Play Store but for anyone who want to play it there will no longer be any more updates or skins or characters added within the game so I can't really do anything about that or really show off anything so if they do decide to come back to it that will be added back onto my list for things to update you all in on but as of right now that is removed Another thing I want to mention, so you see these two cats on the screen, right? Yeah, well, those cats are my cousins. Well, they belong to my cousins. Uh, those are Benji and Shadow. I've shown them off in videos before. Benji was revealed to be a girl and not a boy. And uh, Benji eventually went on to have kittens. Uh, long story short, let me just make this quick for you. Uh, the cats had to be getting rid of. The kittens and Benji and Shadow. So... For anyone that was wanting to see more videos off these guys, I'm very sorry I could never get to it sooner. Life happens, I probably should have mentioned this around the time that it all happened, but if I ever go on to do a video ever again at their little apartment or, you know, townhome, uh, the only animal that you will ever see there will be Milo, which is their black and white cat. So, for anyone that was wanting to see those kittens and, you know, just more of the cat videos in general, I'm very sorry. That's just something I can't do now. Uh, speaking of cousins, so um, Austin or Ice Wolf Aussie, the last time he posted up on his YouTube channel was about five months ago. He has 33 subscribers, 68 videos, and he started his channel up on May 5th of 2020. So long story short, um, all I want to say here, uh, just for anything else that I've already mentioned, the, the long story short thing, his account has been abandoned. The reason why I'm telling you this is because he has created, or a new account has been created for him. So he has a new YouTube channel. So um, I was going to wait until he started posting videos up on there, but he's currently still getting settled in with this account right now and you know everything else going on with his life. So uh, not too long ago, this account was created for him. I have the Gmail, so does my cousin. Love Wolf or Joseph, go subscribe to both of these guys. Uh, link will be in the description for Austin's, but uh, here's the description to his YouTube channel, and 
you know, just junk um, how his content will be. Uh, the account was created about a month ago, or no, actually it was a month ago, on August 2nd of 2022. Uh, Whenever he uploads, it will be a complete surprise, but for as of right now, there's literally no sort of video posted up on there. But remember, if you do want to go subscribe, like I'm saying, link in the description, link to the description, link in the description. I've said it multiple times before. <laughs> the manager is mad and he isn't getting any new customers in a supermarket. Locking up the supermarket so all customers stay here forever. Well, uh, now that that cutscene has played through, uh, now that and all that said too as well. Hey guys, Superfox, and welcome back to the channel. As you can see by the title, we are back again with another Roblox video. For this video, we are going to be playing Escape the Supermarket, Abby, as what was shown in that cutscene. We were locked away by this manager because he's not getting enough customers, so he decided to lock everyone away inside of it. Alright, to start us off, we're at the beginning here. It says, I want to go home, and then we get a shopping cart with the workers. And then, uh, moving on back, it says, I'm so bored. The manager is mad, and then someone's saying, I'm hungry. So, you know, you get all these workers here, everyone's locked away, and we gotta find a way of an escape. Just walk up this person. Alright, quick! Let's get out of this cra er, out of the crazy supermarket. Okay. And then we gotta jump across these aisles. Oops, I did not mean to do that. I literally did a flip and then eh. <laughs> the friggin' respawn sound has the friggin' sonic noise for it. That was weird. Alright, uh, we go down aisle one. Uh, we get a giant box of Reese's Puffs. How nice is that? Looks pretty good. I would assume this is the cereal aisle, considering <laughs> what's on the right to us, but, um... Dang, bro, I just wanted to go grocery shopping, and I'm being locked away in here, bro. Like, I would've spent my money. Oops. I would've spent my money. But no. Also, the series finale for Until Dawn, my little Until Dawn series... That, of that horror game, you know, that, what I've been doing for the past while now. Uh, the next episode will be the last episode. Wait, what am I doing? I literally just came from this way. Hold on, what? My fault. Here, let me just kill myself real quick. That series will be ending off with only five parts of it. Okay, let's try this again. I literally got completely distracted. It's like I have so many things going on in my head right now, like... <laughs> Alright, let's see, what's this? Welcome to my shop, would you like to take a look around? I mean, sure. Alright, let's see, boombox, bazooka, rideable cloud, color splat pistol, jetpack, grapple gun, jetpack, VIP admin. Okay, never mind, I can't even, I don't even know why I started messing with this. It's just something you can get within the store, add it into the game. Not like I even need that. Alright, uh, let's see. What do we got going on for the next aisle? Of course, you can't freaking go through the doors, man. The freaking dude just put lasers up. Like, that should be illegal. I mean, to this day, and, you know, as every Roblox video I go through, or, you know, Obby, for a video that I go on through, it makes me wonder, like, what's the story behind all of this? Alright, let's see, hold on. Ah, great, the milk shelf fell down. What a mess. This is milk. I I'm sorry, this is milk? The this is- <laughs> This is bleach. <laughs> Scrubbing bubbles, this is bleach. Bro, what you mean? Milk. Freaking idiot. Milk shelf, like, bro, what? Now I was just trying to encourage people to drink this stuff. Okay, now we gotta pass on through these freaking employees. Now what? Oh, I gotta walk through- Oh! Oh, 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 okay, okay, I- Man, I'm just trying to get out of this place! I wanna go home! I was trying to go- Wait, what the- 
Are you telling me that I didn't even have to worry about going through that? That I could have just hit the checkpoint anyways? Was that just a glitch? Like, what the heck? Alright, hold on. Go through the jungle gym. Kind of weird that you got a jungle gym within the grocery store or supermarket. Say, what's the difference between a grocery store and a supermarket? Like, I don't really understand that. Like, it does, does it even matter if I run into anything? Ooh, hold on. Um... Okay, no, it doesn't matter. I don't even think... Yeah, see? You can just walk on through. Um... Yeah. Okay, um, alright. Uh, random jungle gym. This looks like something you'd find in McDonald's, you know? Like, those little play places they used to have. Before the store, or, you know, restaurant became all depressed and decrepit looking. You know, there's all that. Oh, we in a toy aisle. That's probably why. Or, you know, area, toy area for the little kids part of the store. Kind of whack. Like, bro, that's just straight come out of McDonald's or something. Like, Jesus. Oh, we got the fruit and vegetable aisle. Oh, what the? Hold up. We got the fruits over here on the side. And now we got just toppings that look like they come from a pizza. What the hell? Somebody freaking just enhance the growth of different foods and your stuff that belongs in a pizza or something. Hold on. Uh, gotta try avoiding getting hit by these fruit that are splattered on the wall. It's kind of weird that they're going straight. You think they would go whoop and then hit the wall right there, but you know. Whatever. Make the obby tobby want, my guys. Or whoever made this. Alright, uh, let's go through the bookstore. And of course, I will check in the ending of this video, and you know, what, by the time this video ends of who created this game, but... Pretty sure it was by Platinum Falls. So I'm not even really trying to think about it. Oh, Jesus. Now we gotta go through this freaking... This... Wait, is this even... Hold on. Is the supermarket like a mini mall or something like that? Because, like, we got a whole book... You said bookstore was a bookshelf area. Like, I didn't really catch on too much of that. How... Huh? I'm sorry, where? Huh? Where? Wait a minute. Did I go this way? What the hell? How am I supposed to get to that door over there? Hold up. Wait a minute. Give me a second. Oh, wait, what the? Oh, I had to find a secret passage. That's stupid. Was I, was I even reading that correctly? Like, did he say you had to find a way around or find a passage or what? Oh, jeez, now we got a construction site. How fun is that? Like, brr. Okay. Mm, oh, 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 hold on. And there we go. Okay, we made it across. Now we have entered a McDonald's. I was just talking about McDonald's a second ago. Is this all, is this all just some mini mall? Because I don't think... I mean, that's kind of like how Walmart is. But I mean, nobody calls it the supermarket nowadays. I think it's literally just called the grocery store. Unless supermarkets and grocery stores are two completely different things. But I don't know. Man, all this food. And you couldn't even share. I mean, thanks for letting me use this as a little obstacle area to pass on by to the next area. But like, I'm hungry now. Like, dang, I know the, all the employees are locked away, but can they literally just take a break for a little bit and then go find something to eat, like, at the restaurants in this place? All right, let's see. The door is closed. Why does this, he seem so happy about this? All right, we will go through the storage room. Like him talking and the facial expression he's making. It doesn't, it doesn't look too... scared. All right. Great, we gotta go to Peter. Alright, um. Just gotta go up these boxes. I mean, that's not really much. Oops. Or maybe it is. Hold on. Uh, how much more do we gotta go up? Okay, this one.
Okay, now we just gotta go through this vent. Among us. And once again, this isn't the first time I say it. If you do want to add me on Roblox, my user is right there. At superfoxy1022222. That's five twos. Not the first or last time. I what? What is this? What the? Would you like to buy a map of the maze? Uh, what maze? Yes? Oh, no, I can't. Never mind. <laughs> you get all these random freaking little pellets of things where you could drink and just buy stuff within the game. But it all costs Robux, so that's freaking great. Okay, so, looks like we just gotta go through a maze within the vents. So what, do I gotta follow this arrow? Oh, God. I'm gonna get lost. Am I even going the right way? Oh god. Oh god. This is gonna take billions of years. Could have at least given me a hint, game. I mean, did that arrow really even help? Oh god. It's gonna take way too long. I don't even know if I should have trusted that arrow. Or does everything else all just circle back? Oh, never mind, that's a wall. Oops. <laughs> Idiot me, you know. Bruh. Okay. That's cool. I don't know if the game's trying to trick me or not. Maybe it wasn't trying to trick me. Maybe I'm just slow. Mm, well, damn. Alright, so where did I originally come from? Okay, right here, and then... Okay, I had to walk straight across. What if I took this way? No, never mind. Do I just gotta walk straight this way? Is that why the arrow's pointing? Nope, never mind. Okay. Just gotta not be stupid about this. Okay, so you go straight in. What if I just went straight? Or is this gonna just lead me to the wall? Yep, it's gonna lead me to the wall. Okay. Um. It all leads back, right? Yeah, it does. Wait. Oh, there's another arrow. Okay. I didn't even notice that. Oh, okay. That that took me freaking way too long. <laughs> if I just tried to look for where the arrow was, I thought there was only going to be one arrow. All right, let's see. <sighs> what do you got to say? All right, another closed door. Now, look at me. He looks freaking happy about all this. All right, let's see. Looks like we were going through the meat freezer. Meat freezer, meat locker. Same thing. Okay, whatever. All right, now what? Okay, I just gotta jump across these boxes. Wait, what the? Oops. <laughs> uh, let's get out of here. And respawn back in, I suppose. Okay, uh. Oh, we have to restart from all of that. I didn't realize. But then I realized, oh, there's not a checkpoint over here. Duh. Okay, um. <laughs> it's cold in here, not playing. Even if it was cold in here, I don't think my character would even notice. I mean, like, look at this. I mean, one day I'm hoping to change my freaking character and junk and not have this stupid floating mouse over my freaking shoulder. But, like, that freaking face is just always there. That smile, the glasses. We chill, you know? Like, we have no emotion with this person right here. This freaking avatar. All right, looks like we tell me how it or not. Where we go, up or down? I have no idea. Looks like we're still in the store and another storage area. I mean, like it's whatever, but you know, what the hell? 
Oh god. Oh. Just gotta freaking walk through whatever this red stuff is. But without walking through, we gotta go around it, I mean. We gotta follow the path. That it doesn't, you know, cover up. Jump like that. Alright, now what? Oh, I gotta go over here. My bad. Alright, let's see. Through the exit! See, this dude's blinking and smiling. Like, ew, that's a little creepy for Roblox characters to just be talking while we're over here in a crisis right now. Alright, now what? We beat the game. Oh, well, it looks like we're walking through the parking lot now. We managed to escape, but now what? What do you have to say, sir? All right, quick, run, to, run away to safety. Okay. Is there like a running sequence I have to go on to? Wait, hold on. There's something on the wall. Congrats on UB visits, Platinum Falls. Your pebble, sand. I don't know what that says, but. I'm gonna just ignore that. Oh, hold on. Sorry, I didn't mean to put on music. Ooh, it looks like we're running. We're running through the parking lot. Oh, 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 oh. And then we work. All right, uh, we made it out. Badge awarded. Pebble Sand one's winner. Okay, so Pebble Sand, whoever that is. All right, uh, use the green pads to play more fun games like this. Um, I think I'm good, but Pebble, Pan Pebble Sands is the user. We have escaped that obby. But then, uh, we got the ending here. It says, hands up! Get down! And then the freaking, uh, I'm, I believe that is the manager right there. It says, I just wanted more customers! So, uh, wow, that's actually surprising. Something like that's ever happened in an obby once. Like, you get locked away in some place, and no police officer really cares. So they just freaking let all that happen. And was I the one who called the cops? I don't know. But, um... That is all we have for today's video. Be sure to like and subscribe. Comment down in the comments below some video ideas. And be sure to stay tuned for the last part of my Until Dawn horror game little choice based making series. Because the ending, I'm, I'm just going to, I'm not going to go into detail, but I'm going to spoil one thing. It's going to be a bad ending. Only two people survive. It's going to be a bad ending. All right. Bye-bye, uh, guys.